I'm so proud that today I can become your husband. I love the way that you sing and dance around the house and make me belly laugh every single day. I love the way your mind works, your positivity is infectious and how you always see the absolute best in people. I love that you're fearless, except for spiders and moths and people knocking at the front door. Um, and I'm always up for an adventure. I love the way that you make me a better person. So today I want to make promises to you that I will always keep. I promise to make sure that I'm not just hungry when I'm a bit agitated. On that note, I promise to share my food with you, to never go to bed angry, and to always watch your factual entertainment documentaries. <laughs> I promise to listen to you when you speak and to stand by your side through thick and thin. I promise to join in your laughter, and when you can't look on the bright side, I'll sit with you in the dark. I promise to grow alongside you, but also to never really grow up. And I promise to love, respect, and to trust you, and to give you the best of myself. I've also been watching you, and I've been watching... <laughs> you know, well, you know, I've been watching you, and I see the way that... By that, I mean both of you. And I see the way that Emma looks at you, and I see the way... She talks about you, and in turn, I see the devotion and the reassurance and the protection that you give to her. I'm looking forward to our future together. Yeah. Firstly and foremost, getting a new fancy boiler with smart heating controls. <laughs> How exciting. <laughs> yeah, welcome to married life. And actually, it's those things which give me great confidence in the strength of your relationship, and also the belief that you will love, respect, and look after each other. Um, Craig, you know, it really is an honour uh, to, and uh, my great pleasure to welcome you into our family. I love that you're a good listener and keep up with the many twists and turns of my detailed stories. <laughs> I love how much you respect and care about your family and how you do anything for them. I love how patient you are and that you help me parallel park my car when I'm stuck. <laughs> I love that you are a fundamentally kind person. I promise to celebrate with you when Liverpool win and blame the ref when they lose. <laughs> I promise to keep reminding you to take your vitamins because I want us to live long, happy lives together, please. <laughs> I promise to stay silly, to never take ourselves too seriously and to stay just immature enough for talking to pigeons on our walks. <laughs> I promise to always listen to what you have to say even when we don't agree, and to remember that love is saying I feel differently, not that you're wrong. I promise to stick by you through all of life's ups and downs. I promise to be willing to face change as we both change in order to grow along with you. I promise to always be your strongest advocate and to treat you with respect and kindness. And lastly, I promise that I'll choose you every day, not because I have to, but because I want to. Emma, from the day you were born and I first looked into your eyes, you stole my heart. And, and before long, you become the sweetest, liveliest, most gentle of young girls that never seem to stop laughing or asking me questions. <laughs> Today, Emma, when I look into your eyes, I see this most beautiful, an exceptional young woman and bride. I actually couldn't be any more proud of the things you've done or the woman you have become. Emma, I give you this ring in celebration of my love for you and as a pledge to respect you and to grow with you for the whole of my life. Craig, I give you this ring in celebration of my love for you and as a pledge to respect you and to grow with you for the whole of my life. So just a big thank you to each and every one of you. Um, for being here, just so we can celebrate with what I can now call my beautiful new wife. I remember one of your first intense Q&A sessions, 
Emma likes to ask questions, as Dave knows. Um, <laughs> on the way to Brighton, um, very nonchalantly. Um, what's your favourite thing about me? <laughs> the, fir the first thing I said was your brain, and I've still not worked out, to be honest. <laughs> when I get home from a, a long day at work, um, I put on a documentary or something, your first comment is, considering zebras have gone to so much effort, they're just not very well camouflaged, are they? <laughs> from that to... This week, doing all the wedding prep, I'm sat in the living room on my laptop, and Emma just walks in with a Sainsbury's bag on her head and a cactus, pretending to walk down the aisle. I was like, great. <laughs> it's just, every day, you just make me laugh, and you, just, you light every day. So whether, whether it's staying up, chatting with you all night about God knows what, dancing with you to Elton John in the kitchen, helping you wipe the food out of your hair when you're a bit ambitious about a meal. Um, I can't wait to spend the rest of our lives together, and I love you a lot. Uh, the first time I actually met Emma was when Craig asked me to tag along on a pub crawl along the South Bank. Um, on first impressions, Craig was spot on. Um, not only way out of his league, and can we just give a massive round of applause for how stunning she looks today. <laughs> but she was bloody lovely, fit right in with our group, and Emma, the fact that you didn't go running the first time you saw that absolutely awful Avenged Sevenfold bat tattoo <laughs> proved to us all that you're a keeper. Looking back now, can I say that we saw a difference in Craig? From meeting Emma, he changed for the better without even realising it. Emma, you brought out the absolute best version of our mate. The time with you both, watching as things got more serious, was a joy to be a part of, right up until you ditched us and moved to Manchester. <laughs> but seeing you up here, thriving, living your best lives on ridiculous country walks, and now in your own home, all I can, all I can say is we're all insanely proud and happy for you. In my eyes, from those pints on the South Bank and every day since then, it's always been Craig and Emma. And I could put my hand on my heart and say, Emma, you are the best thing that Craig has ever found on the internet. <laughs> style a shot of Jägermeister. Personal preference, you could take that or you could take the champagne. No, 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 no. To Craig and Emma. Craig!